welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad that you're here today and today we are going to talk about what I got for Christmas. <laughs> I definitely understand how lucky I am and I appreciate that but these are my favorite videos to watch so maybe they're your favorite too. If they're not, I'll see you next week. It's that simple. Okay, let's get started. <laughs> so the first gifts I received this year were from my crumble swap buddy. This is what she got me for Christmas. She did amazing. So first she just got me some random tea lights for like if you use a tea light warmer. Oh wait, she got me a card too. Her name is Carolina. <laughs> One awesome thing about crumble is every time you order, they send you samples. I don't know, they say they do it sometimes, but literally every time I've ordered, I've gotten samples. Maybe that's because I order multiple bars at once but every time I've gotten samples so she sent me a bunch of her samples that she has she sent me Raz Bamboo Pop which is one that I have had before and I don't really like but that's okay that's just a personal preference it's a tea scent I'm not ugh, I can't do tea and then she sent me gummy bears which is great because I've been wanting to try that one she also sent me vanilla milkshake which is another one I've been wanting to try anxiety relief which I have and I adore and cranberry balsam which I haven't tried but like that's two of my favorite scents, so I'm stoked. Oh, and also 7-Up Pound Cake, which I don't think I'm a fan of after smelling it, but I've been really wanting to try it, so I'm glad she sent it. And then she got me two full-size bars, and the first one she got me is Peak, which I have tried. It's Mountain Breeze and Pine. And then she got me this one, which is one of my favorites. I'm so stoked to have another one of these. This is this will be my second or third one, but it's called 18th and Vine. And if you've ever smelled the, like, Dragon's Breath Renaissance Fair scent... This smells like that, only lighter. She got me two pairs of earrings. The first one is just these like oval hoops, which I love a good hoop. And then the second one is this moon with starry nebula ball pattern thing. And these are really, really gorgeous. And then, she knows me so well. My absolute favorite Disney character is Stitch. I don't know if I ever told her that. I'm sure I did since that's what she got me but she got me this like super hardcore it's stainless steel tumbler that is stitched like how cute is this i adore this i'm so excited and then okay so this was her idea and i was a little skeptical because i am not artistic whatsoever but um i was like yeah sure cool but she had an idea that we would each make each other something and she is an artist so i had no fears about her making me something I knew it would be great um but I am not so I hope she enjoys what I make her anyways she made me this and I like it goes beyond all my hopes and dreams like beyond anything that I would have thought like it's so beautiful I adore it okay so it's this like slab of wood this is the back so the back is just painted black and the front is purple and sparkly with a mickey face <laughs> this is so this is such my aesthetic like oh, i adore this i'm so so happy with this so that's what she got me i love it so much okay so the next gift i got was i don't even know how to explain this person to you she's like a friend sister aunt mother she's known me since i was like a year and a half. I spent a lot of time with her and her family. So she's like another family member to me. So we exchanged gifts and this is what she got me. Also another Stitch Tumblr. Do these people know me or what? Stitch is all glittery. So the next person I exchanged gifts with was my husband on Christmas morning. He got home from work at like one o'clock in the morning and so I think we exchanged gifts then because we were both so excited. And he got me lots and lots and lots of things. So I adore anything that is like small smaller than it should be like that's like miniature in scale i know you've all seen the small little christmas villages they're super cute and i've always wanted one so he got me a couple things for that the first one he got me a mickey's ear factory how freaking cute is that i love this so much also he got me this really adorable billboard for a holiday lights tour and then when i was a small child my grandparents used to take me on vacations because i was their only grandchild so they would take me somewhere every summer and one summer we went to this place and they had a miniature shop and we went in there and i fell in love with little like doll houses so for christmas he got me this vintage travel trailer 
I would buy one of these and travel in it legitimately. But anyways, he got me this and I'm super excited about it. This one actually comes already painted and mostly put together. But there is some things that I have to put together. This is the bag of stuff that I have to put together. Another thing that he got me. I haven't talked about it really. Someday I probably will. Five years ago now I had a miscarriage and it was horrible and devastating and the most physically and emotionally painful thing I've ever been through and so I saw this just a few months after it happened and I fell in love with it and I've wanted it ever since and so he finally got it for me and it's just so beautiful and it makes me cry every time I look at it. Also he got me a couple of books by my favorite authors so first he got me Saving Grace by Denise Hunter which is the second book in I think her first series and then he also got me Unspoken Feelings of a Gentleman by Pierre Alex Ajanti. He also got me some seasons of my favorite TV shows, season four of Chuck and season three of Haven. These are both really, really great shows with some really, really great eye candy. And I would advise you to check them out. They're really cool. This is a story about a random nerd who accidentally happens into being a spy. Also, his girlfriend's name, who's also a spy, is Sarah. And I thought it was so cool because never in my life have I met someone with the same middle name as me. And in the show, she has the same middle name as me. So that was really exciting. And then this is a sci-fi show based on a Stephen King novel. I don't even know how to explain this. People have, they call them the troubles because they're not like powers. Bad things happen, but it's like different for everyone. And there's this big mystery with Audrey and who she is. It's just really great. You should check it out. And then because he knows me so well, he got me a Disney movie. I say that, but like I asked for most of these things. Although he did go off my list and the things that he got that were off my list are amazing. But anyways, he got me Coco. I had been kind of discouraged with some of the newer Disney movies. I wasn't really feeling a lot of them, but then I watched Coco and I was like, okay, like they still got it. This is an amazing story. I adore that movie. Another thing that he got me, Cards Against Humanity. I got the Pride Pack. I got the Geek Pack. I got the Fantasy Pack. I got the 2000s Pack. I got the College Pack. And then I also got the Bigger Blacker Box, which doesn't come with any cards, but we just needed more place to store our cards because we have Bigger Blacker Box and it's over full. Then he got me one of my favorite candles, and that is Macintosh from Yankee Candle. This is so amazing. It's just a crisp, clean, delicious apple. He got me Happy Hippos by Kinder, and they are amazing. He got me three of these five packs, and I've already been through one of them. They're so, so delicious. If you ever see these, definitely pick them up and try them. I haven't tried these yet, but they look very, very intriguing. They are chocolate cat tongues. They are another German candy. I think they're just solid milk chocolate. We should try one. That's what it looks like. Mm, yeah, it's just solid milk chocolate. Mm, that's a good chocolate though. Okay, got me two more things. And I'm so proud of him because these went on my list, but I adore them. I also collect postcards and you know I love Disney. So first, he got me this. Aladdin Disney postcard book and it just has postcards of different scenes from the movie. He also got me this vintage Disneyland postcard of their animatronic elephants on a ride at Disneyland. I just thought that was so cool and thoughtful. He also got me this vintage Disneyland sweater. It has all the worlds on it and it glows in the dark. I'm so excited about this. Okay so that's everything I got from my husband. Let's move on. So then we went to sleep and woke up on Christmas morning and went to my parents' house. I got 20 bucks from my grandpa. My sister got me this magical Lilo and Stitch lounge fly backpack. The inside is this like red with scrump on it. It's so cute. So from my parents, they go so overboard every year. I appreciate them so much. They got me this Dr. Teal lavender bath gift set. There's Epsom salt, foaming bath, body wash, sleep spray some Epsom salt licks. I don't know what else to call them. And then they got me this gift set from Bath and Body Works. It says, you are the best. It's of one of my favorite scents, Champagne Toast. It comes with a lotion, body spray, and a body wash. They got me three Disney movies, actually. Robin Hood. And then they got me Fantasia and Fantasia 2000. 
they got me this special edition Newsweek Wizard of Oz because Wizard of Oz is one of my favorite movies of all time. They got me a chocolate orange because that is a Christmas staple in my family. They got me some solid milk chocolate Santa hot chocolate stirs. This is kind of interesting. I don't really know what I'm going to put on it, but I'm going to put something on it because it's really cool. But they got me this cork coffee cup with a S on it. They got me some more Dr. Teal's lotion. This is coconut oil. We have this big inside joke about how much I hate ranch and every time I would ask my dad what he was getting me for Christmas, he would say ranch and so he did because he's a butthead. They also got me a ton of little white tea lights. They got me this unicorn slime which looks really cool and like galaxy colored. I got some Reese's trees, a toothbrush. We always get toothbrushes every year. I got a ton of pens. I got these wax melts. This is weekend camping trip. This to me doesn't smell like camping. It smells like clean like soap or laundry. I got a bunch of different chapstick. I got a pomegranate, a strawberry, and a pink grapefruit. I got a little mini etch-a-sketch. I got some lens cleaners. I mostly got those because my sister always steals my parents and so they got her some so they got me some. I got some toasted sugar body collagen body cream. I love things that smell good so all these lotions are wonderful. I got a toothpaste. Oh another chapstick. This is coconut and pear. I got some hair ties. I got a stitch Pez dispenser. I got some more Dr. Teal's. This one is lavender. I got a really pretty black glittery manicure set. This is another thing they get us every year. I got a stitch magnet. I got some gummy bears. I got a smoked caramel fireside wax melt. This one smells like campfire to me. I got a couple of really, really pretty emery boards. Less bitter, more glitter. I got some icebreakers candy cane mints. I got a pepper spray. I got a princess bride talking book, which is freaking awesome. I got a Bitty Boomers MSU Bluetooth speaker and my mom hooked hers up while we were still there. And these things are really loud. They're awesome. And then I got some Hogwarts playing cards and because I am obsessed with the Abominable Snowman, I got a Yeti sanitizer holder with some French lavender hand sanitizer. I got this little elephant tea light holder, which is really funny because I already have one of these. My mom has already given me one. She has done that a few times, but you know, it's whatever. I love elephants and he's super cute. So I'll either give him away or I'll have like bookends. And then I got this little collectible stitch with a heart. How cute is he? I got this. I'm so excited about this. I love Clue. It's my absolute favorite board game. And I think like different themed like Monopolies and Clues are so cute. So I was so excited to get this Scooby-Doo Clue. And now I just have to find someone to make play it with me. And then I got another Stitch Tumblr. <laughs> I will never ever go thirsty again. I got some Stitch socks. I got this super, super cute, super soft tie-dye stitch t-shirt. It's like tied up on the side and I think that looks really, really cute. And then I got this purse. It's like a purple snake skin and it has this nice purple card holder. I got a really, really nice, super, super soft and warm Michigan State hoodie. I love it. I got these acid wash Michigan State sweatpants. I also got these. Oh, these are so soft. Anyways, I got these soft elephant pajama pants. I got this teddy bear material sequin stitch sweater. My mom got us all matching shirts like this. Only they're all different colors. So mine's purple and it just says our last name. And established 1988 because that's when my parents got married. And then I got this pineapple tote. It has like a sparkly pineapple on it and it's actually reversible. So it can be black and white or it can be the regular green and yellow. Also for my parents, I got this game called Sing It Back. That seems right up my alley. That's everything I got from my parents. That night I went to my grandma's and she gave me a Tupperware container of her family recipe of Chex Mix, which is what we get from her every year, which is amazing. I love it so much and I look forward to it and I eat it so fast, <laughs> but that was delicious and that's gone already. <laughs> then the next day we went to my husband's family's house from his parents. I got some Color Street nail stickers. 
that what they are? They got me a scalp massager with a pretty blue handle. They got me these two really interesting headbands, but like there's like a wire in them. I adore them. I got a black polka dot and a red polka dot. Also from his parents, I got a Dr. Teal's foaming bath gift set, one lavender and one shea butter with almond oil. Clearly everyone in my life thinks I need to chill out and take a bath these days, which I mean, they're not wrong. Also from his parents, I got a pack of fuzzy socks with elephants on them. And then, because everyone in my life knows me so well, they got me this shirt that says, I'm done adulting, let's go to Disney. Which is just perfect, let's do it. They also gave us some cash monies. And then we also played a game at their house. We played the Saran Wrap game, which is super fun. I didn't think I would like it, but we've played it for like three years now and it's super fun. So I got some miscellaneous gift cards and candy from that. And then my brother-in-law got me this crock pot, which I have been coveting for years. It's so beautiful and I'm so happy to actually finally have it. Look at it, it's just a crock pot full of Pixar characters. How freaking cute is this? I'm so excited. My husband's like, just what we need, another crock pot. And I was like, you always need another crock pot, especially if it's Disney. Mm. He also made us these bowl cozy, cozies, I don't know. You stick your bowl in it and you put it in the microwave. And then when you take it out, you don't have to grab a scorching hot bowl. And then as he always does, he got me a bunch of pins because he knows how much I love pins. First, he got me this specific one that I asked for. And it is the mystery machine. And then he got me one of those random eBay assortments, which I understand isn't good. I actually didn't put one of those on my list for him this year, but he still got one because he's got them for me in the past and he knows how much I love them. And I will not be trading these. So I don't feel horrible about it. It's not great, but it's whatever. I won't show you them all because there's a ton of them, but I'll just go through and show you a few of my favorites. I think there's about like 25 or 30 different pins here. Oh, I really like this little mermaid shoe. I thought this one was pretty cool. I adore this one. It's just like a light blue Mickey head with some cotton candy. I thought this one was really, really cool. It's a little dopey. It looks yellow on camera, but it's actually really neon green. Like it looks like it would be glow in the dark. And I like this old school Mickey. And then this one creeps me out and I'm trying to figure out if it's, does he make this face in the movie? Or is this like a really bad misprint? But like, look, it's Jack Skellington. Kind of. So that's what I got from my brother. Then over the weekend after Christmas, we went down to Fort Wayne to spend some time with my family. So from my aunt and uncle and their children, I got a Bath and Body Works candle, the Aromatherapy Relax in Lavender and Cedarwood. I got a $10 Amazon gift card and I got this book that I asked for that I'm so excited about. It is Mackinac Island Christmas by Gail Gamer Martin. Mackinac Island is my absolute favorite place in the entire world when I can't be there I love to have books to read that take place there so then I exchanged gifts with my best friend and she got me a couple things first she got me this sweatshirt hoodie she ordered me a completely different one and then they sent her an email that they were out of it and then they sent her a different one I don't really know how that works but it's cute anyway it's this gray and it has like a jug on it and it says cider donuts flannels leaves and bonfires and then she got me this necklace with like three different medallions and they're all pictures of my dogs that i've had this is the one that we have that passed away solomon this is our current dog silas and this is our current dog tamar and i just love this so much it's so beautiful and so thoughtful and this is one of my favorite things that i got for christmas because my pups mean so much to me so then we had a party where i work we always do that in january just so we can get past everyone's family stuff. We got a small cash bonus. They've been doing this since I was a small child and they just have like a big table set up and they buy a bunch of really nice presents and then everyone gets like a little ticket and they call your ticket number and you get to go up to the prize table and pick what you want. I was one of the last ones so there was a lot of things that I would have rather got than this but I still got a really nice gift. They had like a TV, they had gift cards, you could get a paid vacation day, they um, do some cash, movies, blankets, I think there was some pans this year, some like camping stuff. There's just a bunch of different really nice stuff. And so what I got was this makeup kit from Ulta. I really like white marbly stuff and then it's just full of different makeup. One of them I already took out and then I think there was some on the bottom too that I've already taken out. But yeah, that's everything I got for Christmas this year. I am so thankful 
for everything that I got, everyone that got me a present, anyone that spent time with me this year. I love you all so very much. I'm thankful for you guys. Thank you for being here. Um, I can't wait to see what next year brings us. Hopefully we can grow together. I'll see you very, very soon with a new video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. Bye.